Mrs. Griffin, your pregnancy is endangering your life. Mom! What's the treatment? To not be pregnant. That's the only option. We could ask the board for permission to perform an emergency termination. Is there a chance that she can survive the pregnancy? Maybe 50%? Resulting in the birth of a healthy child. I'm here. I'm, I'm right here. I vote no, gentlemen. No. 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 This is Jane. How does it work? Joy? Yes. Get in. No, this is not a taxi. You sit up front with me. Oh. You're going to rest for a few hours. Which one of you is Jane? <laughs> We're all Jane. We have organizing meetings. That's the address. How are we going to get through them all? This 11-year-old girl deserves oh, it. Well, this lady has cancer. She was raped. It has to be random. It's life or death for some of them. It's life or death for all of them. Made my mind up. What do you mean? Our class. Let's take a deep breath. You got a knack for this. Could have been a nurse. Could have been a doctor. We are entirely dependent on one man. We can't change what it costs, Joy. It's economics. It's interesting how economics always seems to mean that black women get screwed. Stand up, stand up. So tell me how you ladies came to be, Jane. My wife's name is Joy Detective. Yeah, you told me that. You want to end up in prison? I will answer any questions. I don't want to know. We have something that works. We are of use. Yeah, it's not perfect, but it works. I'm not scared of jail. I'm scared there won't be anyone left to answer the phone. Stand up. I need help. I don't know what to do. This is my fourth message. I'm losing my grip. I can't tell my parents. You have to go back. Let's get to work.